Hi, it's Chris Crocker in the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Center. The weekend is here. Whew, what a week. Windstorm, no power, widespread damage. Uh, hopefully you will be able to use this weekend to regroup and recoup and the power will be back on your place soon. Uh, here's a look at the weekend forecast. A long weekend for many folks for Martin Luther King Jr. Day. For Saturday, low clouds and fog that will be a little bit hard to clear. Uh, we're heading up to a high temperature of 35 degrees. Now, late Saturday night into Sunday, we have a very weak disturbance moving through that is going to bring a slight chance of a few snow flurries. It's not going to amount to much. In fact, it's very similar to the system that moved through Friday morning where, uh, boy, just a few flurries and that was it. And then I think the rest of Sunday, we're going to end up with a bunch of sunshine and there's more sunshine on the way for Monday. So actually a really nice holiday weekend. Here's a look at our 48 hour forecast starting off Saturday morning uh, with some low clouds and fog, particularly right around the Spokane and Coeur d'Alene area. And I think that's going to be the case for much of the day. Here's Saturday at six o'clock. If you do happen to find some filtered sunshine, uh, you are fortunate you will likely find some if you head up into the mountains. Meanwhile, that weak system comes through Sunday morning and a little bit of snow, maybe a sprinkle, I think more likely a snow flurry or two. And then the potential for some more snow in the central panhandle, but other than that, we're gonna be dry and then we're gonna be sunny as we head into Monday. Meanwhile, here's a look at your 48 hour forecast, a little bit broader view. I have the upper level winds on here as well as the surface features. And as we go through the next 48 hours, high pressure in control for Saturday. That system moves through on Sunday and then high pressure rebounds Sunday afternoon and will be with us uh, through Monday and really beyond. Uh, there's a slight chance of a flurry or two on Tuesday, but otherwise uh, we are looking at dry conditions in the forecast. Overnight lows, or I should say morning lows on Saturday will be in the 20s and 30s. Daytime highs on Saturday will be in the 30s with very few 40s on the map, maybe down in the Lewiston area. A look at your seven day forecast. Um, once we are done with those few flurries on Sunday morning, we should be staying dry for the most part, especially though on Martin Luther King Jr. Day where we should have some bright blue sunshine. Temperatures about average, maybe a hair below on Wednesday. Our average high now is 35. So really we are just right in the ballpark through the seven day um, forecast. Well, thank you very much uh, for watching. I hope you have a terrific weekend and that the power's back on and that the cleanup process at your house uh, will be an easy one. Uh, again, thanks so much for watching.